Hey, it's Allison at Core Therapy and Pilates, and I'm doing a, another thing on traveling. Spring break coming up. I want to talk about luggage. Um, I just have this tiny little backpack, but normally when I travel, I carry a bigger Patagonia backpack that you can either, you know, hold in a strap or carry over your shoulder. Multiple ways to carry luggage helps. Uh, so when you're carrying the luggage, if it's a one arm thing, switch arms. Try and do equal times on both sides. If you're rolling a luggage, same thing. Equal time on the right and the left. Um, then if you are lifting your luggage, which you're gonna do a lot getting on conveyor belts through airports and overhead bins, before you lift anything really, you want to take those legs, take a second and really get some tone in them, screw them into the ground, get your good core contractions we've talked about here, bring those shoulder blades down do all that prep work first, and especially if you're in pain, inhale, exhale, then lift, okay? And the luggage, you want it to be as close to your body as possible. Try not to reach over and lift things like this. Bring them as close as you can, and then lift. And then overhead bend, same thing. Keep it close to your body. Push it up. Keep those shoulder blades down when you lift this up, okay? Let your shoulder blades sink down to push this backpack up. Those are just a couple of tips for your traveling. Um, I hope you have a good trip wherever you're going to go. And those are good tips for just day-to-day -day life, picking anything up or carrying anything around. Try to use both sides equally and keep the weight close to your body. All right, y'all have a good day.